This year we were given exclusive access to the South, from the moment the initial 39-man squad was announced, through the training sessions which took place at Netherdale, and the two games against Edinburgh and Caledonia Reds. Among the initial squad were 13 from Hoyk, and also the only player who had played in all four South games this century, former Hoyk and now Kelso back row forward, Bruce McNeil. Head coach was Matty Douglas, who had taken his own club, Hoyk, to great success in winning the Scottish Cup and the Premiership in an unbeaten season. The 28-year-old has been rising through the ranks, and his appointment as head coach was the obvious one. At the first team meeting, Matty set out his stall and welcomed the cream of the crop, some of whom would be selected to pull on the iconic red and white striped jerseys, which meant so much to local players and spectators for over a century, when, before professional rugby came into being, the South would take on the might of the touring South African Springboks, New Zealand All Blacks, Australia's Wallabies, and also teams from other countries. If you boys, this will be your first time in this kind of larger environment, so big thing for me is that we enjoy it first and foremost, but we're here to win. All right, we're not just here to make up numbers. All right, we're prepping for Edinburgh on uh, 9th of May out there. And, and that's the kind of big message for us as coaches is that we're not just here to make the numbers and, and compete. We're here to, here to win. All right, so, One of the great um, things about Borders Rugby is the local rivalry between the town's teams. But something magical happens when those players join forces to play for the South. With limited time to prepare, it was important for the players to gel quickly. Marcus, have you been in at Hooker, Pa? This could be your fifth appearance in the South. You're the only one who's actually played in all four this century. Oh, it's, it's, just, it's a pleasure to be here, you know. It's, um, training always kind of steps up when you, when you come to play with these, train with these calibre of players. And uh, it's enjoyable challenging yourself, challenging each other. And, um, you know, hopefully, listen, hopefully we can gel, you know, quick enough and, and make sure that we, we put our best foot forward going into the Edinburgh game.